Hello everybody, this is Roman, and look around the room, it means... It means mail time! It's going down! We're yelling timber! You better move. You better dance. Yeah, alright. Uh, I really do like that song way too much. I, I know my rendition may be horrible. So far, crossing my fingers, have not had any copyright claims. Um, but, you never know. Kesha may be like knocking on my door, being like, hey, why are you all up in here trying to pretend you're me? She probably talks like that. Um, all right, so I wanted to start off with the invited date. Now, we mentioned the whole, hey, if you're going to do that, put your date in there. And as we can see, people are doing that. Now, as we can also see, I am terrible at this. Um, so that one's kind of on me. Totally did mean to go to that Brickton uh, town hall meeting thingy, by the way. So, I forget what happened. I think I thought it was at... It was, I thought it was like 6.30 Eastern, and then I was busy at that time, and then all of a sudden I see that it's at 6.30 Pacific, and I was confused, and I just, like, I missed it. Darn. So, uh, I did want to go there. Uh, maybe next week. So, I probably should check this more often. To be honest, I don't. Yet I told people to do the date thing. Um, I kind of feel a little bad. Well, let's take a look at some of the things that we missed. I feel like a little recap of things that happened. Uh, Mr. This is a wedding. Uh, ooh, this was the first Brickton District wedding. Did I miss that? Aww. Uh, Minnie Max Sniper and Penguin Love are being married. Uh, let's see. Oh, so the Church of Rome and across from the town hall. All right. Formal or red pajamas. Very nice. Uh, colors red and gold to match our Lord. Oh, man. Uh, I probably got this invitation totally on time. Uh, but it's one of those... I, I Honestly, I didn't check. I need to make this more of a thing. I can't say, hey, why don't you invite me to stuff? And then put dates on there. And then I don't have to follow through, but I, I want to. Um, so, hopefully, Penguin Love and Minnie Mac are happily married. Uh, congratulations, guys. So, give you guys a little shout-out here. Uh, if you are not happily married, or if the nuptials uh, have already run their course, then, uh, hey, you know, better to find out sooner than later. All right. Uh, let's do this. Make that all go away. Ah, another wedding. You know, they apparently they say spring is a time of wedding, but uh, looking, to be, looking to be fall. I don't know. A lot of weddings. All right. Oh, it's the same thing. Boo. All right. All right, different day. Different day. Wait, I sent you an invitation, but after I sent it, the dates and times have changed. God damn it. <laughs> All right, so the wedding was on Saturday. <laughs> uh, you know, I appreciate the effort to try and make sure that's all taken care of. Um, <laughs> all right. Is this... Oh, it's not. Okay. Those haters were... But since you're interested in hate mail, I will give you a run for your gold. Get ready for hate... Why is this in a... Is this because they put a date on there? No, there's no date on there. Ah. Uh, who was that? And... Hey, what do you know? Evil Benny's gone! Also, I'm not sure if that command actually bans them or not. If it does, um... Uh, I'm sorry... But if you know I'm in here, then you probably know what's going on. And then I'm not. So there. But good call. You were right. Uh, let's see. So this is a haters thing. All right. Hold on. We're going to... Wait. Oh, wait. What was going on here? Just actually area. Um, get lost. Get wrecked. All right. We're going we're gonna... to... That's not really a go die thing, but it's a... Okay, why does that not then go ins All right. Boom. Okay. So those are, okay, three things with dates. But, by the way, kudos on putting the dates in there. So, I mean, hey, well done. Uh, that's just sort of a little bit of things that just don't end up happening. Is he back? No, oh, he's back. That's okay. Uh, let's see. What do we want to do? We did Q&A last time. We did... Let's see, how are love notes looking? That's a lot of love notes, but... 
Love notes should be used sparingly. Um, these are urgent. Nah, not in a mood for urgent. Ooh, let's look at some applications for squires. All right, this is what we'll do today. You know what? No, we're gonna grab some more. Grab some more. Uh, yeah, there we go. All right, we got the fire going. Yep, there we go. Just hang it out. Let's uh, wait. Let's do. Let's do. Let's do the. Let's do the which way? Which way do we want to go? Want to do the crooked neck? Crooked neck. All right. This is how we're gonna read. Dear hiring manager, Lord Roman, Holy Grail, applying for secretary. Nope. Throwing that one out. <laughs> that didn't work. Uh. Whoop. There we go. All right. Sorry. Secretary post has been filled. We're no longer accepting applications. That was probably from a while ago, so I'm not think someone's trying to jump in on this. Um, but uh, no. At some point, maybe the secretary job will either be expanded or transition. I don't know. Again, zero complaints so far. Uh, this has been uh, a stellar arrangement. All right, secretary. Uh, wait, okay, well, this is kind of a... I do believe you must sit down and talk with potential squire or secretary, someone who leaves your application. Uh, because you don't want another squire mishap like what happened to Deadbones. Ah, yes. Okay, uh, also true. I talk to pretty much everyone for squire or secretary because uh, they don't always go well. Um, so it's something where... What do we, what do we got? No, it's someone else. Who cares? Um... They don't always go well, and it's it's a pain. It's a pain in the ass, to be honest. Um, I don't like having to sh shuffle through those. I've had some bad luck, bad luck with some squires. Um, I'm not going to lie. The common theme is most of them were significantly younger than I was either expecting or hoping. Um... So I'll probably try and set some kind of loose age restriction on being a squire in the future. Um, I don't know, 18 plus, 20... I mean, this one of those... There's people that are... Eight, I'm still a child, for God's sake. So it's not like, oh my God, this age means something. But you're really rolling the dice if you get a, you know, 15 or 16. Now, if you're 15 or 16 years old out there, you're like, oh my God, I'm so mature, blah, blah, blah. I'm not saying you're not. I'm just saying the odds are I'm going to get a dud and someone who's basically going to make be a pain. Number one rule of being a squire, don't be a pain. If I have to worry about it or be concerned about what you may or may not be doing, that that means you're being a pain, and that I have no use for that whatsoever. So um, that's that you just don't do that. It's pretty pretty simple. I'm not, I'm not a monster. It's just something where um, I don't want to have. It's not something I feel like I should have to manage. So, oh, get, get close, yeah. No, go, go back a little bit. All right. Uh, another secretary app. All right, uh, let's just chuck that one. It's a very terrible, ooh, jester. All right, uh, but none of them have a jester who can make you laugh and show you a good time. I'm intrigued. Ah, uh, we know what you mean. Um, unless you want that from, wait, yep. I like this guy already. Anyway, see so if you could you would hire me as your own jester. I'm willing to work for free. I just want a chance to perform to royalty once more. My last job, I worked under King Poos himself, but got banished from the castle at making one too many vacation jokes. Yeah, really sensitive about the vacation stuff. Like, come on. Um, if you're interested in hiring me, please come over to the Buffalo Theater right across the street from the post office. Uh, just look for the Buffalo statue. All right. Uh, finally, after looking across uh, some paper that luck, across some paper that luckily I could read, I saw that a lord could only have three squires, but there's nothing about however many jesters a lord could have. So if you're interested, please stop by. No, not not so shabby. You know what we're gonna do? I put this in the maybe pile. I like it. I like how he's thinking outside the box. Though I think I heard something about the jester thing coming up before. I don't, I'm not gonna give him like a hundred percent credit. Ah. Uh, Wow. Just, wow. Really? Oh, 
Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, let's do this. God, people are... Why, why, why? I don't understand. No, not that, that. Here we go. Yay, this is what I get to do now. Because you're an asshole. Ah, <sighs> Alright, well this is fun. Alright, let's get rid of the potion of death. I don't want to ruin the vibe that we have going on here. Alright. And now we return to our uninterrupted... There we go, I have to do the little crooked neck thing. Alright. Uh, Cat Guy has a plot. It is a re... You know what? I need to go take a look at Cat Guy's plot. That's a good point. Um, Lord, you can use me. Okay. So it really wants to be a squire. Uh, you know, I still was going to read squire ones. I guess I should actually read them. Uh, jungle, ten janky juice. Promise to protect my king and defend my lord. I shall speak no words. All right. Give me the oath. Not so bad. Uh, score for... Soar for... I'm a great builder. So for... So for so much to read. All right. I'd be really happy if I read this all the way. All right. Um... To be fair, someone that's a really good builder is a plus. I don't really see that as a requirement. It was something, I'm not going to lie, I was looking for at one point in time. Because, like, uh, everyone has all this cool stuff. I want cool stuff, too. Um, you know what I would like even more than someone who's a good builder? Someone who I can just be like, hey, build stuff. And they're like, all right. And then next thing you know, there's things. Whatever they may be. It's, it's more imagination. I don't care if you just Google cool stuff how to build in Minecraft and then you build it. Whatever. It's just a matter of it comes down to micromanaging and I don't want to have to do that. Um, right now, super happy with who I have right now. Uh, Faden and Slash Ryan are awesome. And so far, they've been doing really well with the strike system. So, you know, cross your fingers. Nothing bad happens because that would be a shame. And if you notice that I didn't mention someone, that doesn't mean anything. Or does it? Ooh, who knows? Uh, I'd like to thank you for responding to a letter about your future regard future about your future domain. Breaking RP. Uh oh, yeah, this is about surfs. Yeah, no idea how I'm gonna handle the surf thing. Um based on the Really? Really? Ah, <sighs> You know what? We might take a little bit of a segment. Good news, guys. We are breaking a little break into the news section. Uh, let's see. Um, let's do this. Hey, B-Ball Benny. Um, I'm at your house. Wait, no. Which one's his house? Is this his house? Uh, no. That's Thrillian. Alright, which one is his? Hmm. Alright, let's try this again. We'll go here. Literally drops me right there. Which is this guy. I feel cheated now. Ah, here we go. Okay. I wonder why he didn't give that to me the first time. Uh, you know what we're going to do? We're going to give him the old... Alright, uh, let's do... Yep, so we're still on this one. Hey, what do you know? wonder what's going to go here. Yep, we're playing the old TNT game. Uh, are we going to be subtle? Nah, we're not. Uh... This is what we're gonna do. Uh, do, 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 do. Um, just to have some fun. And let's see, we'll put some in the oh, we got a little roof access thing going on here. And I don't know why it's so hard for people to just not not bang on doors. It's not complicated. Maybe this is what he wants. I don't know. Sometimes the worst thing you could do when people want attention is actually give them attention. However, 
In this case, I get to blow up their house, so... I kind of feel like I still win. Um, let's go through here. Alright, don't want to damage too much of someone else's house. Uh, Alright, let's do this. Uh, ball, Benny. How's it going, B-Ball? Alright, let's do a little bit of this. A little bit of this. Oh, that didn't blow up much. And... Yep. There we go. It has been fixed. Alright, so... Hopefully he likes the renovations. Um, there we go. Uh, let's see, one more thing I think we could do that would make this much better. And no, no, B-Ball, you will never be a surf. In fact, here's what we're going to do, B-Ball. Uh, we're going to go biblical on this. Um, we're going to do this. Boom, there you go. There is your friggin' house. It's a wall of bedrock. You can't do anything with it. There you go. Have fun. Uh, there's some stuff below I guess you can make. Uh, let's see, what, what can we do? Let's, let's do this as well, just, just to make it better. Um, boom. Oh, wait. Did I not do it right? There we go. Okay. You know what? We're okay with that. All right. So, you know, if you think that I'm recording something, just just don't don't make click doors. I don't understand. Doesn't make any sense. Uh, really annoying. Kind of ruins it for everyone else. Um, and now these other people have a giant bedrock wall next to their house. It's not what I wanted them to do, but it's better than him having something that he enjoyed. So, oh uh, wait, let me put a sign up. Uh, let's see. Um, let's see. I like to click doors and interrupt lords. So now I have a giant bedrock house. There we go. And just pinch to grow an inch, and there we go. All right, that is a not the twist I wanted on the mail episode, but it's what we got. So thanks for watching.